everyone, it's Sam here, and welcome back to my channel. Happy Monday! Yay! We survived the weekend, right? So, I had a great one. I hope you guys did as well. I thought I would start this week off with a review for you guys. I've been getting a lot of questions on how my Gucci card case has been holding up, so I wanted to share my thoughts with you guys on this. So, um... Real quick, I'm going to look at my phone because I have the uh, details here, but I want to talk about the dimensions first just to get that out of the way. So it is, let's see, okay, it is four and a half inches by three and a half inches by one inch in depth, and this is empty, so I don't have anything in this wallet yet. It is this beautiful, I'm trying to think of it's a nude color, but on the Gucci website, it just says nude, so there's no specifics or anything like that. Um, it comes in seven different styles currently on the Gucci website, and it's $395 for the all leather one. So I know it comes in red, it comes in black, there's a white, then there's this color, they come out in the, um, the canvas with the GGs all over it. A bunch of different things and they all range from $2.95 on to $3.95 so this one's $3.95 all leather um, except for the exception of the inside of the cash holder it is like a nylon type material but we'll get to that later all right so when I bought this baby I was super excited I've been really into compact size wallets lately I don't know why I just like adore them and I want all of them in my life so I got this knowing that I would love it and yes three months later I still love it I think it's amazing I think it's great value for money the amount of use I got out of this I think I told you guys I used it for like a month and a half straight before um, I gave it a break and nothing is different about it. Um, so with that said though, I just pulled it out of my little storage. I just keep it in its dust bag, which looks like so. It's just like a little flap one. Um, I pulled it out of its dust bag and I noticed that the edges, there's no wear on the edges like scuffing or anything like that, but, and this might be kind of hard to see, um, but they kind of turn inward. I don't know if you guys can see that. So instead of being like completely straight across, it kind of curves down just a little bit. And I think it's just maybe from normal wear or in because it's a softer leather, um, that it did that. But I just wanted to note that for you guys. It doesn't bother me because looking at it straight on, it still looks great. You can't tell a difference. Or from the back, I don't know if you guys can see that as well. But yeah, so anyway, I just wanted to share that with you guys. So again, using it a month and a half straight, I have no scratches. This leather is super durable. I'm not quite sure what it is. I think it's a calf skin. But because of the stitching, um, I think it makes it a little bit more durable too because it's like every half an inch or whatever they're stitching. So it just makes it feel pretty indestructible. But um, yeah, so like I said, I think it's a calf skin. It's soft, but it feels really durable. So I appreciate that. I love the little embroidered GGs on the back. I think that is so cute and definitely was a selling point for me. I love details on things. So when you open it up, it looks like so. You have four visible card slots, a large one back here with another card slot there. And then behind these two, you also have a third one. So you have a lot of storage for your cards. Um, I filled this up for you guys a while ago. <coughs> Sorry. And I had 16 cards in here. So I had four here. And then I had 12 back here, and then I had my insurance cards back here, which were just like the little paper ones. And then on top, you have a cards or a cash slot. So, and I wanted to show you guys, I brought out my wallet that I'm currently using, which is my LZIP wallet. I have um, a dollar bill in here, and it. I just wanted to show you guys, it does hold a dollar or it does hold your bills without having to fold them or anything like that. So as you guys can see, 
which is really awesome and something I think is really hard to find in a compact wallet is something that's able to hold your cash without you having to fold it. Um, I'm not like a huge fan of having to like take my cash and like fold it up into like these little origami pieces in order to fit them into my wallet. So I really appreciate that Gucci has that here. So I am just overall really happy with my purchase. I think it's a great wallet. I, I don't know if it's a forever wallet for me, but it's definitely something fun um, that I appreciate and I love using in my small bags. So that is my thoughts. It's held up great, you guys, with the exception of the corner curves, but I mean, that's, I'm assuming it's pretty typical wear, nothing I did wrong or anything like that, so who knows, but anyway, that is my review. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any more additional comments or questions that I didn't cover, please leave them in the description, or please leave them down below, and I will put in the description bar the, the item number, pricing, and all of that information for you guys on this specific wallet. So, I will see you guys later. Bye.